Hi, Nagi. How are you? Uh, hello, sir. I'm fine. How are you? I'm, I'm good too. Thank you. So, first of all, uh, many, many congratulations to you for getting selected in multiple companies. Uh, thank you so much, sir. Mm -hmm. So, uh, can you tell me something about uh, your introduction first? And how, how did you get these companies? I mean, how did you get the jobs in these companies? Uh, sir, my name is Karthi and previously I worked in the Global Logic. And after some, uh, like, uh, after working about 2.9 years of uh, in Global Logic, I decided to switch my company. So I prepared uh, uh, in software testing. Uh, so uh, I prepared for multiple companies. Even I am rejected from multiple companies. Like I face uh, n number of rejections. Uh, around five to six uh, rejection I faced and after you know I was a uh, little bit depressed so I connected with you uh, that uh, what should I do and after like giving mocks to you I feel a bit co uh, confidence in myself I feel confident so I give uh, interviews after that and uh, then I selected in uh, uh, one startup company and after the uh, MNC in MNC company I got selected and in MNC, I got 110% high, mm -hmm. and in startup, I just got the 60 to 70% uh, high. Right. And coming, yeah. Yeah, yeah, please go ahead, please go. And coming to the resources, like I prepared from, like I prepared from YouTube videos and the Udemy okay. courses. And so your managerial interview questions are also helpful. Okay. Like I just refer them and uh, okay. like most of the questions are from them only and uh, whatever the scenarios you are uh, asking in the interviews question like in mock interview, these are also helpful. Like after giving the mock, I am able to collect two, two to three interviews in a row. Like okay. I'm also shocked that uh, I'm able to crack it and okay. it was very helpful. Like mm -hmm. I feel more confident after giving that interview and I like I feel that the, uh, most of the questions are the same that you were asked in the mm -hmm. mock and uh, other interviews like I follow your uh, mock interviews as well mm -hmm. so most of the questions are from them only and some are the concept based also mm -hmm. so uh, these uh, resources I preferred while preparing for the interviews Got it, got it. Great, great. Yeah. So you have, uh, you told three years of experience, right? Yeah, yeah, sir. Like I have 2.9 years of experience in Global Logic, but I uh, do some internships, so that uh, will also count it. Yes, yes, absolutely. Great. Yeah. So how much hike did you receive? Uh, sir, I received, uh, in MNC, I received uh, the company that I was joined. It was of MNC company. Mm -hmm. And I received 110% of hike in my current salary. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. So, how many interview rounds were there? Uh, sir, there were three interview rounds. Like, mm -hmm. first was the screening round where the, uh, you know, basic questions were asked by the some uh, senior testers. Mm -hmm. And uh, there, I think it will be around 40 to 45 minutes of round. And after that, the lead and the manager round was there. And other, and third round will be the HR and the director round. In okay. nature and director round, uh, there are some uh, scenario-based questions related to testing and the projects. Mm -hmm. Most of the questions are from the projects uh, uh, in HR and the director round. And uh, two rounds will be fully technical. Mm -hmm. So, is it possible if you can share a few of the interview questions that were asked to you? Uh, yes, yeah, scenario-based interview questions. I have got the list of questions from you, but apart from that, any other practical or scenario-based questions? Uh, yes, yeah, sir. Yeah. First question was that uh, how we log bug in Jira. So I have to write the whole process, mm -hmm. and even they give me that uh, give me one bug, and I have to you know uh, write it uh, write down its test summaries. And their uh, steps to reproduce, and uh, what we what will be the actual and the ex expected result. Uh, and one uh, question was like uh, they give me one site uh, full of errors, like one page full of errors. The I think this was the form function of uh, the, that page will be the form functionality of some application. 
so i have to find the errors over there and they told me to just do the exploratory testing and found bugs in 5 mm. minutes they give me minutes also like you have only 5 minutes to find bug mm. and uh, uh, another was one like uh, i said that i performed the smoke testing also so mm. they just uh, share me the login functionality and uh, uh, tell me that uh, in this functionality, uh, how much smoke test is, uh, test cases you may run and uh, how you do smoke testing in this. Uh, share me the, like, what approach you follow. Hmm. And uh, they show me the standard website also and uh, uh, told me just go for it and found some, uh, you know, errors in it. Like some spelling mistake was there or some integration issue was there. And uh, uh, I think, uh, yeah, and they told me to wrote some test cases also of some functionality. I don't remember the functionality right now. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe it was a uh, payment functionality, so payment functionality. So they told me to wrote some test cases also. And uh, for, uh, like some SQL queries, they also given like, uh, I have to uh, withdraw the highest salary or from the employee code. Like, I don't remember the query, but uh, mm -hmm. these are some SQL qu qu queries. And uh, some, uh, like they also told me about the store procedures, like how we use store pro these procedures at, and store function over there. So mm -hmm. these are some practical based questions. Okay. Yeah. All right, right. Fine, great. Now, uh, how did you came to know about this job opportunity? Was it from LinkedIn? Was it from Nokri? Was it from some kind of uh, any any source? That... Uh, sir, I just applied the Nokri uh, through okay. Nokri, and uh, the recruiter will contact like the recruiter contact me, mm -hmm. and uh, I just applied in the Nokri and the LinkedIn as well. But I didn't get much call from the LinkedIn, but I got most call from the Nokri. Like I updated my profile over there in two times in a row, like around two, 12 to 1 and uh, another time was 3 to 4. So mm. I got most of the calls uh, from Nokri and I'm receiving uh, till now. Okay, great. So yeah. do you feel that uh, a candidate, a person who is looking for job opportunity, opportunities should mm. purchase Nokri premium or should purchase this LinkedIn premium? Mm. Would those uh, premium subscriptions be helpful? Yeah. No, sir, I didn't purchase any kind of premium. Mm. I just update the, my all skills uh, over there and I update twice in a day my mm. Nokri profile. And even I just refer your videos also. You share some job updates. So there mm. also I have apply. Okay. And these are the approaches I follow. Like if mm. I uh, use LinkedIn and if I got some jo uh, job opportunities over there, then, then I mail them too. So I follow these kind of uh, uh, and I be very consistent in this. Like I at least uh, mm. apply uh, twenty to thirty jobs in a day. Oh, okay. Yeah. So what was your score in the Nokri profile? Like, did you get some score there? Were you able to see? Yes, sir. It's it's uh, around seventy plus. Like 70. we can't achieve. Yeah, we can't achieve hundred percent. Mm. If we want to achieve, we have to buy premium from them. But seventy, uh, around seventy score, like we got calls mm. from the HRs. Okay, so any specific list of technical skills that you had mentioned in your resume, which you would like to share, which after which you started getting the calls in the Nokri from Nokri. Should I just highlight my projects and whatever the skills uh, I was using in that particular project? And some uh, extra uh, skills like uh, test ng selenium, like I was in the, like I just mentioned over there that I'm familiar with it. Yes. So like these are in the markets. Uh, there are some keywords also like I just uh, copy from the chat GPT okay. and I mentioned uh, uh, these keywords in my resume too. And yes. I just update my resume according to their job description, uh, job description as well. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, I get shortlisted over there. Wonderful, wonderful. So, uh, the chat GPT. So, can you elaborate more on how did you use chat GPT for creating your resume? Uh, sure, I just uh, take some keywords from the chat GPT, like uh, 
comprehensive in api testing and road test like right test cases like uh, if we give uh, like i if i just simply wrote a, like i want a resume like i want some keywords related to api testing and the test engine or the selenium so the mm -hmm. list of keywords are appeared in the chat gpt so i just uh, use some keywords uh, and uh, apply in my resume wonderful wonderful that, that's great yeah that's i just uh, check the ats friendly like ats uh, score also in yes. google how much it is ats friendly like there is some algorithm the hrs are using Mm -hmm. So if it is score was fine, so uh, there are more chances, more chances that your resume get shortlisted and you will got calls. Absolutely, yes, yes, true, true, correct. Okay, great. So, uh, let's say the people who are looking for the job opportunity these days, how should they do the preparation? Should they do should they focus on managerial questions? Should they focus on technical? Because these days, interviews have become very, you know, altogether different process. Yeah, it's yeah, like, sure, it's... definitely. Yeah. I faced seven, <laughs> seven rejection in a row and I was very, you know, underconfident that I am able to crack it or not. Hmm. But uh, focus on the technical as well as the manage managerial are both important. Both play a vital role. Like if uh, you clear the first technical round of interview, then you have to face the managerial one. And there are equal chances that you got unselected in the managerial one. So mm. both are the important. I can't say that uh, focused in more in technical and focused more about in the managerial. Both are play a vital role in my, in my, uh, uh, like I interviews. face like yeah. yeah in my interviews I face that both are in uh, both are play a equal role. Sorry, sorry. Okay, got and there are are more scenario based question uh, in tech uh, technical interviews like they hardly ask about the definitions and all. Uh, they just you know if they ask about the regression testing as well, then they want then uh, they want that you relate that keyword into your project like you explain uh, uh, what type of regression you perform in your current project hmm. like they want some example related to your project only yes yes so it's more of a kind of a meaningful uh, like you have to connect those things those terms terminologies with your day-to-day -day projects right. yes sir definitely right right Okay, Gargi, I'm done with the interview. Do you, I mean, I'm done with your success stories uh, coverage. Do you have uh, anything to share apart from this to the community? Because these days, the job market has opened and uh, people have started getting calls. So it's a good positive yes, sign. Yes, sir. Sir, it's a golden chance to get a new job. Like, I'm receiving multiple calls till now. Mm -hmm. So uh, the job market is fine right now. So whoever are chasing the job, it's a good time to switch or uh, go for a new company. Or you, if you are a fresher, then it's a good time to get into a company. And I just want to thank you. Like you supported me a lot in this journey. Yeah, thank you. And all uh, good. I mean, you also put a lot of efforts, a lot of hard work you kept. When we connected for the mock interview, Yes, I do remember you were able to recall the the answers for most of the questions. But it was just that your confidence level, maybe yeah. some were nervous at that time. But it was good. I am really happy that the mock interview helped you in uh, getting the real time. Yes, sir. And your managerial interview question are also helped me a lot. Like it was a, uh, you know, passing journey to me. Like I cleared two to three rounds because of it only. Okay. Okay. Great. Great. Wonderful. Yeah. So thank you so much, Gargi, for coming thank on our channel sir. and sharing the success story and wish you all the best for your career and your future. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.